Hello everyone, I'm Hema Priya. On behalf of Sri Aurobindo Society, I welcome you all. In this video, I'm going to talk about new age experiential innovative ideas, which was compiled by Zero Investment Innovation for Education Initiative, that is ZIIEI. So in this video, I'm going to talk about a zero investment idea, which was brought up from the state Dagar and Nagar. There was a innovative teacher who described an innovative case study called self-study. So we all know that self-study or maybe the self-learning ability or self-learning skill is the most important skill that has to be inbuilt right from their childhood age. So a teacher wanted to make sure every student to learn that self-learning ability skill. So then only they can do many, many, they can learn many, uh, you know, many uh, degrees or they can learn many things in their lives. So a teacher would be making a small idea uh, which is called, you know, passage reading, you know, passage reading and taking that quiz. So that was an innovative idea. So a teacher, it's, it is always usual that teacher would be discussing about some topics. So when discussing that topics, there would be a quiz added questions. For example, let's say a teacher wanted to discuss about a topic called trees. You know, how these trees are all formed, how important to plant a tree. These are all the things would be there. So a teacher would be discussing about what, uh, what, what is about all a tree and on all the uses of tree, characteristics of tree, all would be discussed in the classroom. So after discussing this, all the students has to uh, fold their notebooks, all they have to close all their notebooks and they have to sit ideally and the teacher would be giving uh, asking a question through a quiz format. You know, there will be a groups. Let's let's to make it really interesting. Let's uh, filter out the groups. A group, B group. A group contains of 20 members, B group contains of 20 members. So there are almost 40 members in the class. The question would be asked, you know, first of all, why do we plant a tree? That is the first question. Why do we plant a tree? Because trees, you know, uh, the answer will be like this. Trees are really important to us because it gives us oxygen. Okay, it takes out, uh, takes in carbon dioxide and gives us oxygen. So we can really uh, live fresh and lot more years by intaking of this oxygen. So that is the first step to build a, to uh, plant a tree. So that is the first thing. And uh, students will be asking, okay, what, what about, what about the other uses of trees? Second, second quiz question is, what is the uses of trees? You know, by using the trees, uh, we can, uh, there's a respiratory thing, it would be this one. And there are some, uh, not only useful, that would be that trees, you know, when the trees are really old and the trees are, is not that much giving any, and, you know, it, it doesn't have that much use, the trees are cut it down and that cut it trees would be used for uh, building buildings. Okay, civil engineers would be using that for building it. So trees, trees are not about, not at all wasted. No, that, that cannot be waste. So it would be taken out. Okay, what about these uh, leaves? What do, what do the leaves? So that leaves would be used for some medicinal things. There are a lot of uh, neem trees and all would be used for medicinal thing. And neem would be used for to prepare a soap and all. So there are a lot of uses in that. So like this, a discussion. It is a discussion as well as a quiz which should be taken between sp uh, students and the teachers. So this is how you can make interesting. So when you make this interesting questions, students will really le learn many things. Not only in the passage right from the whatever in the academy book, they will also get the information outside the box and they will learn about it so you can also make the small activity classes in your uh, schools you can implement these in, uh, simple innovative ideas if you wanted to know more about our innovative ideas you can subscribe to our channel called ZIIEI if you are watching this video on the Facebook make sure you like our page thank you so much for